Okay, so let's take a look at how you can use if else statement in GD script. For this, we are going to download Core R Engine. And once downloaded, what I'm going to do is open that executable, which should open window like this. Here you can create new project or open your existing one. So let me open my existing project. Here you can see I changed the splash icon. Now next thing, here you can see I have added new GD script by right clicking and then new script. Okay, then make sure to create that file and then also when you create your scene which is node 2D or 3D, make sure to attach your script. Okay, once you attach, it would appear in attach script. Okay. As you can see, currently everything is blank. You get default underscore ready function and extends node statement as well. Now here, what I'm going to do is within my ready function, I'm going to create one variable. Let's say n set its value to six. Right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put if else statement. So if n is equals to 6 colon then I'm going to print n is 6 right next thing is using else right colon print again n is not Six. right now what we can do is we can make sure that script is attached to our sin right if it's not attached then make sure to attach it and then run your code now here you can see n is six what if we change the value of n to say four now Let's run it again. And here you see, n is not six. So when you are using if and else statement, you are pretty much writing it in way you will find Python code is being written. So if you have some Python programming background, then you'll be finding it easy to make use of various GD script uh, syntax like this if else okay so few things to note here is you have to use colon when you end that if statement so that immediately when you move to next line it will get some tab space for your print line same with the else you have to end that else statement with colon then use tab for the next line okay so you get the idea how to write if else statement in GD script within your Godot engine project.